Hey guys, welcome to this uh, very cool video that I have going uh, today. It's very important to me, mainly because not a lot of YouTube sites do this, but this is what makes the Grid Gaming Network awesome, is because today, I got my prizes, which you can't see that way. Uh, like Hyperstone Heist, the original Turtles game, some Turtle Package cards, I almost dropped that. And then uh, two Game Boy games. Uh, one which is Fall of F Foot Clan, and the second is a faceless game. Uh, so I figured, uh, what better way to show off these games and show, say thank you to the Grid Gaming uh, than playing them. Got my Super Nintendo with the Super Game Boy hooked up, so you can try the Game Boy games. I got my Genesis ready for some Hyperstone Heist, and yeah. Let's just start playing them, talk about them, say thank you again. Uh, first thing I want to talk about, uh, the Turtles cards that I got sealed. Uh, these guys are never going to get open. I actually had a bunch of these growing up, so I would like to say thank you again for Aaron. I'm going to put those right up there. So, thanks Aaron. Oh, second one. Uh, so, the next thing I got is the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game on the NES. Uh, one thing I wanted was I got everyone to sign it. So everyone from the Grid Gaming signed it. So that's really freaking cool. Uh, like I said, that's awesome. I really, really can't say thank you enough for this, guys. This was a really cool thing. Really cool addition. So that's going to go up here. Okay, so that's pretty much the first things that I have going off. Uh, let's start the Game Boy games. Because everyone wants to see what the uh, Game Boy games are. Uh, so let's start that up. So the first game we're going to talk about, guys, is Fall of the Foot Clan for the Game Boy. Uh, haven't played this before, but it's actually going to be really fun because I actually like playing first games for the first time. Uh, artwork's awesome. The artwork on this Game Boy cartridge is hands down the coolest thing. It reminds me of the old comic book, so big fan of that. So let's try it out. Uh, let's just get right into it. Figure uh, stage one. <laughs> we can skip all five levels. So I can just go straight to the end. Uh, Aaron, if you beat that game and it's saved for me, thanks. Ooh. Biggest, hardest uh, turtle game I've ever had to deal with. Always got to go with my boy, Leo. Okay. That, that's an attack. That's a jump. Okay, I gotcha. Boom. 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 Okay, I got this. I got this. What? 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do we got there? I got a kick. And I got a slash. I got a kick. And I got a slash. Don't hit me. So, not bad. Not bad. Game's uh, a little fun. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, I could definitely see uh, in the early age of the Game Boy days, this game would have been right up my alley. I would have been playing this game for hours. Uh, definitely for road trips. It's very easy, but it's kind of hard at the same time because it's got a good uh, kick feel into it. Kick. Ooh, full life. Okay, so yeah, this is definitely a good game. Alright, cool. So, Fall of the Foot Clan, not a bad game. I actually enjoy it. It will be fun. I'll go through the game and uh, definitely rack out uh, all five levels. So, cool. So, the next game I want to talk about is the Faceless game. Now, I haven't seen this game. I don't know what it is. I'm going to show you guys. You guys aren't going to be able to see this. Because I'm going to blur it out so that everyone has the sense of illusion. So, uh, yeah. Let's try it out. See what game we got. And go from there. What? I'm just I'm messing. I'm messing with you guys. I'm, I'm not. I'm... That, 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 that's, that's me. Okay. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's a good sign. Good sign. Konami. Very good sign. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, I like that. It's definitely a good game. Raphael. Donatello. Michelangelo. Leader. Uh, turtles! Cool! We got another- back from the sewers! 
Uh, this game, this game I had when I was a kid. This game is fun. Oh, uh, we'll start. Okay, Raphael, Donatello, Michelangelo, or Leo. I'm <laughs> not gonna lie, it's kind of funny. The heads and the body are the exact same across the playing field. I mean, look at that. Uh, Raph, Donnie, Mikey, and Leo. All same head and body, just their arms are holding something different. Uh, but yet again, let's go with Leo. Oh, that's cool. I like that. That's a cool picture. Screen cap. Okay, so definitely graphically compared to the last game. Uh, really cool. Oh, okay. That, oh, they changed the buttons on you. So A is jump, B is attack. <laughs> I got my kickback! Alright, cool. Uh, quick little slash. So graphically, it definitely is improved from uh, Fall of the Foot Clan. You can actually see, like, it looks like a turtle now, but it's weird because it's at a side point of view. Oh, look at me when I talk to you. That's right, keep walking. Uh, but it's going to be pretty cool because it feels like a side scroller, but I just wish they were to tilt the head just a little so I can see it, so it's not just a side scrolling platform. Uh, ooh, I can do a flip! Look at that! Flip and a kick! Flip and a kick! Flip and a kick! Uh, no, game's really good. Oh, you get damage now? Pizza brings back health. What? When does pizza not bring back health? Um, no, fun game. Fun game. Definitely uh, interesting. I'm not gonna lie. I, I definitely want to go through this and try to complete it. So this, I'm more than ecstatic about. Uh, this is really, really cool, Aaron. I really can't say thank you enough for finding this and using it as one of the prizes. Um, Hyperstone Heist. The Genesis version of Turtles in Time. Uh, I had this when I was a kid. Lost it when I went to summer camp. Don't know what happened. Uh, but really, really cool. Like Aaron said, it is complete. It's got the manual and the game. Uh, so this is really, really cool. The game is actually in really good shape. The label is nice and crisp. Uh, no fading. Uh, awesome. Awesome. So, can't wait to try this out, play it, relive my glory days. Alright, so, Piperstone Heist, let's play it. start this up. Hmm. One or two players by myself. Gonna go one. Alright, so I did all the others. I'm gonna pick Leo. Duh. So, cool. Uh, so, if you're a fan of uh, Turtles in Time, you'll notice opening's fairly similar. Except for one thing. What's happening? Where did the city go? It disappeared. The city and the Statue of Liberty disappeared. Thank you for correcting me, April. Oh boy. Who's that? That that that's the guy from the thing with Armageddon and the Bruce Willis. That's the guy. Cool. Okay, so we're in the sewers starting off. Uh, normally, Turtles in Time starts you on the Alley Cat, or not the Alley Cat, uh, New York, but there is no U New York. So let's go. Okay, come on. Oh, yeah. So it, it handles, literally, guys, it handles just like it. It's really actually kind of cool to be playing this game again. Uh, super, super fun. Oh yeah. Come on, I'm gonna do the thing where I can throw you at the, the, the screen. Did this game not do that? Oh, there you go, okay. Yeah, you just gotta, it takes a minute to get warmed up. Piece of time. Ah, oh, those stupid robots. I hate stupid robots. Uh, look at that, yeah. Really, really fun. Stop! Um, no, 
It's really cool. Uh, oh, dude, you can do supers? That's cool. Alright, so that's one thing that uh, you can't do in the other game. You can't do a super move, which is kind of cool to see. So, pressing two buttons down to jump and attack button, you get super. So, kind of reminds me of the Turtles Manhattan Project in that retrospect, but uh, the drawback is every time you use a super, you lose part of your life because I was full health and now I'm dead, pretty much. So, kind of cool. It's a really fun game, not gonna lie. Really, really fun. That's, that's going right up there. Uh, really guys, in closing, this is honestly one of the coolest things I've ever seen any YouTube uh, show do. There's not a lot of people who actually listen to their fans, or ask for feedback, or actually talk to them. Uh, this was one of the coolest things I've ever seen on YouTube. Seriously. Uh, really, really cool. Uh, Aaron, thank you. Just thank you to everyone. Thank you for the contest, everyone at the grid. Thank you, Aaron, uh, Greg, Josh. Elizabeth, Taylor, um, you guys are awesome. Keep doing what you're doing. I know I'll be watching, and I'm pretty sure everyone else that's following you guys will be watching. Thank you to the contest entries. I was very excited to see how many people actually entered the contest in the first place. Freaked out that I actually won the thing, but awesome contest. Uh, Chapas, talking to you, bud. That was an awesome picture. Thank you. Uh, like I said, guys. I can't wait for the next contest. I can't wait to see what everyone brings to the next contest. Subscribe? Subscribe to the Grid Gaming. Uh, click this button. Right here. Yep. Right here. Click that button. That's going to link you straight to the Grid Gaming's uh, uh, YouTube site. Really, really, really cool. Uh, other than that, 